My name is Jeff Green and I'm the Executive Director of Students on Ice and I'm also on Canada's National Committee for the International Polar Year. I, my uh, career and life has been touching on the polar regions now for almost two decades. Uh, I've been to the Antarctic 71 times and the, the Arctic 40 some odd times. Um, I often joke that the penguins recognize me when I arrive uh, to the beaches of the Antarctic. Um, and my, I started a, as being an expedition leader, leading different types of groups to the poles. Uh, scientists, film crews, tourists, um, crazy adventurers. And uh, in the process of having this incredible opportunity to go to the ends of the earth, um, it became obvious to me that these were two of the most incredible parts of the planet, cornerstones of our global ecosystem, barometers of the health of the planet, uh, symbols of, of peace and understanding and conservation, and of course also incredible platforms for education and science. In fact, I like to think of the Arctic and the Antarctic uh, as the greatest classrooms on Earth without walls and in the yeah so with that in mind uh, about eight years ago I started this program called Students on Ice it's uh, based um, in Canada but it's an international program we've taken now over 800 high school students and university students uh, on educational expeditions to both the poles and they travel on these journeys together with a world-class team of scientists and experts and artists and musicians and educators. Um, and for the International Polar Year, um, we're really excited because over the next two years during IPY, we want to take uh, another 600 students from all over the world to both the poles. And, and really, the purpose is to inspire these youth, motivate them, and give them the, yeah, the, the, the background and the, the passion and interest and so on for them to be the next generation of scientists and leaders and engineers and environmentalists. And I think the polar regions are the best places in the world to do that.